I've been doing robotic uh, colorectal surgery for over 12 years now. I think it has transformed the way we care for our patients with cancer um, and also for non-cancerous conditions. You rely on very high quality 3D image, which is 10 times magnified, and then you have a very stable platform to operate. When I came across Scopi glasses, I was quite impressed initially straight away because it felt quite lightweight. In simple terms, what it gave me was a head-up display of what was going on in the operating field. So I thought, okay, well, that's interesting. I can have the glasses on and I don't have to take my own glasses or reading glasses away. I can have them on and these glasses on top of it, look through it, and I have in front of my eyes in 3D what actually is going on in the patient. It could solve quite a few other problems which are facing surgeons right now across the world, which is about the ergonomics in the operating room. The assistant could be by the bedside and then there's a robot in front and there's a trolley with the nursing kit on one side. There could be a monitor by the foot end, there could be a monitor by the head end, straining your neck and back and head position and that can be tiring after a few hours. Normally I'm sitting next to the patient. It sometimes is a little bit tricky to always hear because we've got bits of equipment in the way. Scope Eye is good for giving you more visibility. It doesn't mean that you're not twisting as much, you're not craning your neck to see a screen around people. In that respect, the Scope Eye is very good because you just can be in one position and wherever you're looking actually, whichever direction your head is in, you are still seeing what the surgeon's seeing. You're in sync with them a bit more. I think when you are an assistant, especially if you are training as well, uh, ergonomically this is much better to be using the scope eye because you, uh, you don't have to be twisting your head to look at the screen and also it gives you exactly the same view as the surgeon on the console gets. So I think that speeds up your training process, I would expect. The, their depth perception will get better. Um, they are not blinded by the glasses, so they still have the peripheral vision to pick up different instruments, to, to move around between the trolleys and uh, do the troubleshooting with the robotic arms. It's a very immersive view, but at the same time, you still feel the part of the outside operating field. My operating room is often full with visiting surgeons and trainees and fellows, but there's a capacity to what we can cater for, and sometimes many do not get the view that they still want to see. Uh, and this can be surgeons at very different stages of training. And again, I think Scopi is a great addition for people getting exactly the same experience as the surgeon or the trainee sitting on the console. I was amazed because in the beginning I thought it would be something heavy causing me headaches. Finally, I found something really natural, as if I am in the robotic console, uh, as if I'm watching what professor is watching now. So it was just an excellent experience for somebody that is getting trained now in robotic surgery as me. I think Scopi is, uh, is a great innovation. It's immersive, it gives you full control and the high quality of the image. There is no lag, there is no detectable lag in terms of the view that you get through the lens as opposed to the monitors and uh, the quality is phenomenal um, and it just gives me that versatility whether it's teaching, training, mentoring, proctoring, assisting or teaching juniors, it could have multiple uses. I think the versatility, the ergonomics, the aesthetic design, I quite like it, it's quite slick, nice and lightweight. Thank you.